world. You are rocking the free world. You are rocking the free world. All right, so it's that time again, ladies and gentlemen. You want to buy my van? <laughs> I keep getting emails asking if I'm going to sell it. And I've, I've explained before that uh, anything's for sale for the right price. And um, there's going to be some changes in my life soon. Uh, not giving up the lifestyle, don't worry. But uh, I am going to take offers on my motorhome uh, starting immediately. And I'm going to do it just the same way I did with the last one with Dora. That's my Chewbacca text message there. Um, if you want to buy my rig in all its glory, own a little piece of YouTube history. Um, send me your offers. You have to go to, don't, don't post in the comments. Uh, send me a message via YouTube direct message. Or uh, even better, just go to my website and use the contact form there. And uh, I'm going to open up the bidding on this vehicle at 35k. That's USD, of course, uh, because I'm speaking to a broad audience, and it's you can if you're in a different country, you can convert it uh, pretty easily. Um, now, I'm not going to take any less than that. Uh, the same way I did Dora, I'm not going to sell it if I don't uh, find somebody that actually has the money up front, and of course has enough of it. Uh, for me to make it worth my while to start another project, which I, I'm looking at right now. I'm just not going to get into details. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave it open until the end of this month. Uh, my birthday is actually the end of this month, so we'll see what happens. Um, I'll leave it open uh, till then, and if something comes along and they're serious, then uh, who knows what will happen. So what happened with my last one is I had a whole bunch of people flooding me with offers. Only a few of them actually had cash in hand. If you're a cash buyer and you're looking for a compact Class C, aka Class B Plus compact motorhome that's fully equipped for off-grid with security screens so nobody can break in and you've got good ventilation year-round. Um, it has the Kimberly Wood stove, so as you know, that is many thousands of dollars on its own. It has a 200 watt dual panel uh, solar system. One of them is on a tilt mount and it has an HDTV uh, TV antenna, it has um, a six speaker stereo system, indoor and outdoor music, and it has a surround sound home theater with a LED TV as well, with a 1000 watt pure sine wave inverter um, running the goodies inside. This doesn't mean I'm gonna sell my RV. When it happened last year, it was just stroke of luck and the timing worked out perfectly for me to go buy my next RV. So, um, I'm going to take all the offers uh, through my contact form on my website and I'll be in email contact with those of you that are uh, you know talking to me through there and want some more information on this and those of you that make offers on this um, no tire kickers you guys can all go look back at all my videos you know all about this motorhome she is in beautiful shape she needs as absolutely nothing except for you to move in if that's what you're planning to do with it if you were to buy this from me. If you're in the States and you want to bring it over the border, it's super easy both ways. I mean, I brought a vehicle over from the States. That's how I got my last one up here. And then the people that bought my last one brought it back down to the States. Uh, it, it's really not that difficult. And Vancouver is literally half an hour from the US border. Uh, you can always have it shipped too. Um, and that's uh, an option that I took when I brought my Dora up from the US as I had it shipped up here just to save my time and energy and I couldn't take time off work to go drive across the continent so you know there's all sorts of options out there but when it comes to these types of motorhomes as most of you know who've been searching for them people keep messaging me saying they can't find them there's only at any given time between one and five available somewhere in North America the chances of you finding what you want in your own city is is next to nothing um, when it comes to small compact motorhomes like this and certain class B's and things like that uh, so, really, when I'm looking for a new motorhome, f for what I need, this type of motorhome, or the one I had before, I search the entire continent, in both Canada and the USA. It doesn't matter to me what city it's in. I mean, I know I'm not going to find it locally, or it, it, it's possible, but it's very unlikely. So, uh, those of you uh, out there who are searching right now, though, and keep messaging, asking if I'm going to sell it, look, just give me your offers, and let's see if it happens, all right? 
Uh, if it if it doesn't happen by the end of the month, uh, I'm not going to sell it because it's all set up for winter. I'm ready with the wood stove. I love this thing, and uh, I would rather do it maybe in springtime uh, when the weather gets warmer again. All right, let's see what happens, guys. Keep on rocking in the free world. Right.